Okay, so in the position that you have held at the places you've been, Amber, all of those places, you know, always want to have stars because they're conglomerates or they have a lot on the line. But we all want to know, with regards to online content, are you guys just as open to non-stars creating something or is it always going to be that you kind of give credence, even if the show's not that good, to, to something that, you know, Kevin Pollack is a part of, not, not his show being good or bad, but just that you're always going to look to stars first? Well, it goes back to who's going to drive audience. At the end of the day, I have to have a return on my investment. And so if I am investing X amount of dollars um, on a no-name production, I expect to get X amount of dollars back out of it. So they have to have some special sauce, whether it's they built an audience of their own online, it's um, interactive material that somehow, you know, uh, engages an audience. At the end of the day, it's audience, audience, audience. That's how you monetize content. So the reason stars or celebrities is um, usually factored into content is because they have influence over audience.